Hello everyone, welcome to another Rick's Picks. Today I'm going to be doing my review of Masters of the Universe Origin figure, Trapjaw, the mini comic version. So, before we get into this review, I just want to remind folks, if you like what you're seeing, please subscribe, share, and hit that notification bell so you can get, you know, more content. So without any further ado, let's take a look at this figure. So here's Trap Jaw in box. Um, it's a standard Masters of the Universe uh, card pack. So you have the logo, the Trap Jaw name, and this is a universal figure. Uh, it's not one of the American ones because you can tell because it has the multilingual um, explosion there. It has the 40th anniversary logo. Spin them around this way. And you can see this nice piece of art of him zapping He-Man. You have the international blister here. You have everybody who's part of this wave. Uh, his play features and all the legal. And once again, and I say this in each video, uh, the other difference with the universal ones is that you don't have the nice description up here. It's just the artwork without the top description and the lower description. So, spin them back around. Without any further ado, let's take a look at them. So here we have Trap Jaw out of box. Um, first thing you'll notice that this is just a repaint of the original figure. Uh, it's painted to look like the original mini comic look. Where he was a green and silver opposed to his blue and black. So let's give him the rotation. Got this side. And got the back. We got this side and now back to the front um he has the standard points of articulation for the trap jaw figure his jaw does move up and down the head is on a ball joint this shoulder goes up and down and then you have a joint here and a swivel okay on normal arm you have your standard shoulder joint you have an elbow joint, and you have a wrist joint. All right, on his torso, spins at the belt line. All right, he has the thigh joint right here. He has a knee joint. He has a rotation at the top of the boot. And then he also has... An ankle joint. Alright. So get him back on his stand here. Now one thing I notice. About this figure. And it's the same with the other trap jaw. Is the original one. When you pop the arm off. This piece here. Would come off with it. But this is actually part of the sculpt. This does not come off. Unlike the original figure. That it did come off. He also has the standard zip line hole in the top of his head um he his belt is tighter on this figure i noticed that like normally trap jaws belt is a lot looser you get a lot more play or this one's a, on there really tight so without any further ado let's take a look at his accessories he comes with the standard trap jaw accessories so you have the blaster which you know Fits nicely right in here. Okay. He has the hook. And each piece has a little tab. That you can see right here. So they can hook onto his belt. So we can just put his hook right here. And he also has his claw. Which you spin it around this way. You can put the claw right here. So, and they're all interchangeable with the arm. So you can use either one with the arm. Um, and also, he comes with this mini comic right here. Uh, this is the standard book for this wave. So, you know, you open it up. You got the nice artwork inside. Now, once again... This is the other problem with the Universal books is you don't have the 
your speech bubbles. It's only the artwork. They took all the speech bubbles and dialogue out of it, which kind of stinks because you do want to hear, you know, what the characters are saying and what have you. But still, at least you got the mini comic. So that is a plus. Overall, he's a cool looking figure. Uh, if you're into variants and alternate colors, I would recommend having him. If you're just looking for the standards, then stick with the original trap jaw. Or the original trap jaw is a harder piece to find. So if you can't find the original one, he's a little bit easier to find. So at least all things considered, you have a trap jaw in your collection. So anyway, this is my review of trap jaw. I hope you liked it. If you did, Hit a like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell for more videos. Also check out my He-Man Masters of the Universe Origin playlist and leave a comment. I'd like to hear from you. So until next time, later.